Today we're gonna to take a look at a tripod by K&F Concept. This is the K255A6. This is such a nice tripod. I can't tell you enough about it, how much I love it. For starters, this is my rig that I've been using. I'm using the Ulanzi Quick Clips on here, so I just give this a pinch and I can pull my rig off right away. This allows me to shoot vertically with my phone, as well as I have a GoPro for the wide angle stuff. So this is really great. I love this rig that I've kind of built myself. Really awesome setup, but let's get into the actual tripod itself. This unit is all aluminum and we have some anodized aluminum on here, which makes it really pop. This thing weighs 3.5 pounds, has a capacity of 26 pounds. So you can put a 26 pound camera on here or rigging, whatever you need to do. Fold it up, this is 17 inches. It comes with a bag, which I'll show you as well. And at maximum height, it's 78 inches. This thing also turns into a monopod if you want. So I'll show you how to do that too. On the top, we have a 32 millimeter ball. So you just give this a little turn and now you can adjust your rigging wherever you want. On this side, you just undo this screw and this slides right off. So I'm gonna take off the Ulanzi mount because that doesn't come with it, but I highly recommend these guys. So this is a quick clip as well. If you don't have the Ulanzis or something like them, this just slides in place and you just give it a twist and it locks in really nicely. So this little quarter inch screw can adjust back and forth so you can center your camera on the tripod. It also has a small level right here so you can kind of level the tripod as well. And the head of this rotates. So this is your locking screw, rotates. You've got some numbers down here so you can kind of map out exactly where you were shooting. Let's say you're shooting that way, 240, then you can swivel over to 300. So you know exactly where you were when you're doing your shots and you don't have to guess. You can be exactly lined up. Now, the overall tripod, we've got so many different adjustments on here. It's a twist lock style. So you undo these two and you can extend this all the way up. You can lock it off just like that. Lock this one off and we're set. You don't have to have both of them. So you got lots of options there. This unlocks and this part pulls up as well. So that's a really nice feature. When you're wanting to pack this thing up, you just push the legs in, push this button down, and fold it all the way up, just like that. You do that for every single one, then you can push this bottom piece through. So when you fold it up, you wanna make sure that this part is pushed all the way through, you've locked your nut, and now you can close it up, just like that. So super compact. Now it comes with a carrying case with a shoulder strap, so you can just slide this right in here, do it up, there you go. You got a handle or you can flip it over and carry it just like this. So now let's take a look at the monopod. So the monopod section is two pieces. First off on the leg, we have a padded piece. This unscrews. So you wanna take this off. That's your monopod right there. Next off, we have this main shaft. We have to take this off and attach it to the monopod. So to do that, we have to unscrew this little clip on the bottom, which also has a hook so you can dangle things from there. After we do this, I'm gonna show you how you can shoot upside down with this thing. So now you wanna undo this nut, slide this shaft out, and on the bottom, we've got a threaded area, so this can just screw right in, like that. And now you've got your monopod. So these just all twist unlock, and then you can lock them back together however long you want. So it's really tall, I'll go full extension on this so you can see how tall it is exactly right there. So keep in mind, I'm six foot one. So the camera is just a little bit higher than my eyesight. So I'd actually have to lift up a little bit. So really great for tall people. So as you can see, it's really tall, but you can go even taller by undoing these two and extending this even further. Really, really high, 78 inches, it's amazing. So we can lower all this back down and everything has rubber on it. So it's really nicely padded. So now if you wanna shoot upside down, all you have to do is flip the tripod over like this, extend these out, and you could undo, let's say the bottom leg for now. So now our tripod is essentially upside down, so you can get those closer shots to the ground, or if you wanna do some product shots, you could even lengthen these legs so your tripod is even higher up, and you could shoot straight down onto some product. So it's endless on the capabilities of this tripod. I think if you're a traveler, you do a lot of travel blogs, travel vlogs, whatever, this is something that would be perfect because it is light, it's compact, 
it's sturdy, it's all aluminum. All the parts on this feel really well built and they're not going to break or snap off. So that's what I really like about it. The fact that I can move all these parts around so easily is just perfect for me. All right guys, I absolutely love this tripod. It is going with me everywhere for all my shoots. I hope the video was helpful. Until next time, keep on crushing it and we'll catch you later.